so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi. Have you ever seen yourself in a mirror? Wow, isn't that cool? You're like, eh, and it's like, eh. <laughs> How about you and I draw a mirror today? I'm going to start with the color gray. And I'm going to draw an oval and then some squigglies, just like that. Yeah, it looks like reflection, right? And then I'm going to take the color pink whoa, and go around that and then draw a little cute little thing up top and then go around and then I'm going to draw the handle. Whoa! And that's how you hold on to the mirror right there. So then you can go, how do I look? <laughs> I look great! <laughs> just like yesterday and just like the day before. <laughs> wow! That was so much fun drawing! Do you like drawing with me? Yeah! If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> all right, let's do this. <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I, Flippy. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Cool, cool, cool. Hey, it's me, Flippy, and I was just acting like a bird. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> a stork, to be exact. Yeah, storks are really big birds, and they have really big beaks. Why don't we draw a stork together? Okay, here we go. Let's draw a big marker and then start with the head. There we go. Whoa, and the body, a little squiggle. <laughs> Ooh, and right here. Wow, it's starting to look like a bird. Yeah. <laughs> First, let's draw the big long bill. Yeah, it's kind of like a triangle, right? And then, here we go. And the eyeball, there we go. But you can't forget about the legs. Two legs with cute feet, just like that. And then the wing, that's how they fly. Ooh, and then sometimes, yeah, in stories, they can carry babies. Cool. Well, if you want to keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy, good job. See you again. Bye-bye. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippy. And you know what we're drawing today? Yeah, a bulldozer. Yeah, I love bulldozers. They're so big and heavy. And they pushed with that front blade anything and everything out of its way. All right, let's use the color orange. A lot of pieces of construction vehicles, yeah, are the color orange. All right, so let's draw a line right here, a 90 degree angle, whoa, and then another line, and another line, and down. Whoa, what does that look like? Yeah, looks like a backwards L. <laughs> this is where the engine is, and that's where the operator sits. You need to give them a square for a window so then they can see, and then does a bulldozer have wheels and tires or tracks? Yeah, tracks. <laughs> so let's draw a very, very big oval. Wow, there we go. Yeah, and then we need to draw the blade. Whoa, kind of looks like a moon, doesn't it? And then we need to connect that just like that. And now that looks like a bulldozer, but you can't forget about the ripper. Whoa, cool. Well, if you love drawing with me and you want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B L I. P-P-I, Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Hey, 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 it's me, Blippi. Have you ever wanted to be an astronaut and go into outer space? Yeah, me too. Maybe you and I should draw a rocket ship together. Well, let's use the color purple. Yeah, rocket ships are how astronauts get into outer space. So let's draw a point right up top. Looks like the start of a triangle, right? And then these two lines go straight down. And if you connected right there and right there, which we won't, that would be a rectangle. Instead, we're gonna draw a circle for the porthole. All right, let's draw a really small rectangle down here. There we go. And then we need some fins. Yeah, a couple straight lines just like that. Whoa, this rocket looks fast, doesn't it? And then a straight line right there to make another rectangle. 
Ooh, some dots? Yeah, for some bolts, so it stays all connected. And then, some flames! Yeah! Whoa! Wasn't that so much fun? Whoa! If you wanna draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name! Will you spell my name with me? Yeah! Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I. Flippy! All right, see you again! Hey, it's me, Blippy. Have you ever been outside when it's raining? Yeah, what do you hold in your hand? Yeah, an umbrella, so then you don't get all wet. Why don't we draw an umbrella together? First, we have to draw a big half circle. Whoa, and then three smaller half circles the other way. There we go, and then we need to draw a letter J. Yeah, just like that, for the handle. Doesn't that look like the letter J? <laughs> I know. And then if we draw lines like this, yeah, it has little sections that we can color it in and make a very colorful umbrella. So let's add some red right there. Whoa. Let's add some green. Whoa, there we go. And let's add some blue. Whoa! Now that's a colorful umbrella. Whoa! If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah! B L I P P I. Blippy! All right, see you again. Bye bye! Hey, it's me, Blippy. Today, you and I are going to draw a fish. Wow, I love fish. Yeah, they just love to swim underwater. Some are big, some are small, some are fast, some are slow. And today, you and I are gonna draw a purple fish. All right, I'm gonna do a long arch like that. Then I'm gonna go straight up and then do the opposite. Whoa, yeah, see that really wide triangle? Yeah, that is the tail fin. All right, now for the lips, I'm gonna draw a sideways heart, just like that. Oh, so cute and a small circle for the eye. Ooh, a curved line. Yeah, to separate the back from the front. Oh, there we go. All right, and what does it have on its body? Not fur, yeah, scales. All right, there we go. Whoa, this fish is so cool. All right, I'm gonna draw a top fin up there. Looks like a triangle, right? Ooh, and a bottom fin. But I can't forget about some bubbles. Woo, woo, whoa, yeah. So cute. Well, if you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I, Blippi. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Hey, it's me, Blippi. Today, you and I are gonna draw an animal. And this animal looks like a horse, a bit smaller, and it's only black and white. Yeah, a zebra. <laughs> Since the paper is white, let's take a black marker, draw an oval for the head, an oval for the body. Ooh, and let's draw a rectangle right there for the neck. Well, kind of looks like a square, but let's draw four rectangles on the bottom for the legs. Whoa, there we go. <laughs> All right, now let's draw some flowy lines for the tail. Whoa, now it's starting to look like a zebra, right? Yeah, we need an oval for the ear though. A circle for the eye. Ooh, a curved line for the snout. Ooh, there we go. And a smiley face. And then what do zebras have? Yeah, stripes. So let's do some stripes just like that. Perfect. Some on the neck right there. And then we can't forget about the mane. Whoa. Let's color in the mane black. There we go. Oh, what a pretty zebra. Well, if you love drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout.